the ability of the computers and the machines to get smarter is so far proven to be unlimited. The role of AI and how it is going to transform the healthcare industry. I would actually zoom out a little bit and not just talk about AI. I will just talk about the roles of computers and machines. And I think AI is going to be just a part of the of the machines. We have seen uh, computers and machines transform our lives. You know, today the productivity of every person, you know, some people might say that people spend too much time glued to the screen and, you know, playing video games or social media. But at the end of it, when you look at the role, and this is this is already documented well by 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 the economist, by the uh, sociologist, that actually the computers and the machines have really improved the productivity of our society. Right? Uh, whether you are driving your car and not getting lost, looking at maps or just from your memory, this is helping you get better. So the computers and the machines are playing a bigger role as, and will continue to play a bigger role and we are going to cross a certain threshold where the computers and machines will actually be able to do most of the tasks better than what a humans are able to do today. And the ability of the humans to improve their productivity is limited. The ability of the computers and the machines to get smarter is so far proven to be unlimited. Computers, computing and AML is going to change everything that we do. And we're already beginning to see that, whether it's self-driving cars, whether it is navigation systems, whether it is logistics, how uh, diseases get identified today by looking at uh, the pictures, it's changing. Because the ability, as more and more things get more digitized, as there is more and more data, the machines will be able to analyze that data faster, more accurately than humans can. And that's going to have a big impact in the healthcare. So earlier we had talked about finding the right patient. Let's assume that the data was all available and it was all connected and cleansed. The computer today can go out using AML and find every patient that has any chance of having a disease. When we get into the genomics and the genetics data, they can actually predict who's going to have a disease in the future. And maybe we can actually take corrective actions today and examples like this is going to revolutionize healthcare and healthcare delivery. Thank you.